Mo says, so glad you opened this segment to everyone watching this. I realized I could leverage my line of credit 6.75% by just transferring it from it to pay off my credit card of 12.98 within the same bank. Cool. For those of us who's been following you and leveraging your strategy for a while and with little debt, but still want to connect with you, which of your program would you rec recommend we sign up for? So Mo, at the moment, um, you know, I, I did all the promotion I could possibly do back in uh, September, October, November, December. I'm not taking on any clients from now till April 1st, okay? So what I'm gonna be doing in the meantime from January to April 1st is having private financial workshops like this, okay? We can ask me questions, let them be direct, let them be clear. But at the moment, I am not taking on any more clients. I'm at full capacity. If you're watching, most of you watching right now are in the Velocity Banking Manifesto, you're a one-to-one -one client. Um, I'm specifically focusing my time on you guys, the ones that are already in the program over the next 90 days. I, it gives me time to create the content I need to create for the whole year. It gives me time to create wonderful results like this with my clients. It gives me time to improve, to study, to get better. And then boom, come April 1st, I'll open my gates again into the kingdom and we can work together. So in the meantime, if you're someone that's like, Denzel, I need to work with someone. You've got Matthew Pillmore, VIP Financial Education. Mike Adams, Think Wealthy with Mike Adams. Carmen and Darius, um, The Velocity Channel. I forgot his name, but it's called The Velocity Channel. Um, you know, there's, there's quite a few small, like if you type in like what is Velocity Banking, Velocity Bank, there's a lot of small YouTube channels that have been starting up lately that they know me, I know of them, and I would assume they're in alignment with some of the stuff that I teach. So it's like, if you're absolutely looking for coaching right this second, those are the people I'd recommend, you know, especially if it's for velocity banking, um, you know, cash value life insurance, whatever it is. Um, those are the people I think are very credible. We got the Quack brothers. Um, who else? There's Gary Gunderson um, and his team, you know, so there's, there's help out there, but at the moment, I'm not taking on any new clients. I'm, I'm a quality over quantity type of a guy since day one. That's kind of been my, my, my jam. It's working well. I'm not breaking that. Paris says I owe 50K on a rental home and 70K on my own home. Which should I pay off first? Okay. So Vera, the name is familiar. I don't know if I'm thinking of the same Vera, but if you are the same Vera that I'm thinking of, you've been watching me for quite a while. That's a very disappointing question to ask. If you're the Vera that I'm thinking of, I'm calling you out. That's a disappointing question to ask because I just gave you the steps, number one. Number two, I've got hundreds of videos that answers that question. And number three, it's not a cookie cutter, pay this, pay that. You know that, I know that, everyone in this room knows that better than anyone. It's not a cookie cutter answer. So what do you do? Let's repeat it. Vera, what are your four major numbers? What are your four major numbers? What are you bringing in? What are you spending? What's your debt? What's your cash flow? What are your numbers? Where do you stand? Okay, you got that. What's your debt tool? Okay, you got that. What's the interest rate on the debt tool? Okay, you got that. What's the interest rate on the debts? Okay, you got that. You know the rules, how we chunk. Run the numbers. The last thing I want in this kingdom, in this community, the last thing I want is for the people to follow one man. That's terrible. This is why I teach in such a way where you become self sufficient. You don't need me, nor should you. The only thing you need is the kingdom, which is your infinite resource of wisdom, knowledge, intelligence, resources. I am part of those resources and intelligence and wisdom, but by no means should you be reliant on a man, okay, to solve something like that. You have the wisdom, you have the intelligence, you have access to the kingdom resources, why are you not accessing it? A better question would have been, hey, it's 2022, I owe 50K on a rental home, cash flowing X at bomb percentage, and I have my own home at 70K at X percentage, and I'm paying this. Is it wise to continue to pay this debt off, or should I sell it, should I refi to get cash? 
those are more effective questions to ask, especially in a private session like this. You know, those, those are, it, it gets us to the solution, you know? So like I said, it's not cookie cutter. Know your numbers, run the numbers. Then you evaluate it. You say, okay, okay it's gonna take me two years. If I do it this way, it's gonna take me three years. If I do it this way, it's gonna take me four years if I do it this way. But if I try to increase my income in 10X, it might take me a year and a half, just faster than all the other ways. Okay, the difference is there's risk here, no risk here. Is there an in-betweener? Maybe, let's figure that out.